Hey guys, thanks for tuning in today. We're gonna go pick up a Type R Turbo today. Nothing too crazy to film on the way. Just gonna go pick it up real quick and then I'm gonna take a video of it and show you guys what to look out for when you guys are buying a used turbo. So, hope you enjoy this video. So here I picked up the turbo. Just wanted to do a quick little visual over glance at it. And the next clip, I'm gonna go over what to look for. All right, you guys, I picked up the Type R turbo. The guy I bought it from was a Honda technician. Said this, got, this came off a Type R with about 12,000 miles. Apparently that Type R had some bypass valve issues and that's why it's missing the bypass valve solenoid here. And Honda itself doesn't sell that individually, so they had to buy the entire assembly. So that's why I got this turbocharger here for cheap. One of the things you want to look out for when picking up a turbocharger is looking at the blades right here and making sure it's not, there's no scratches along the housing here and that these blades are, look good. Another thing to check for, make sure it spins nicely and that there's no shaft play. And then same thing on the other side. Guys, just wanna make sure this compressor wheel here is also looking good, that there's no markings along the housing right here. This one's a little hard to see cause this is where all the hot gas is. So, you know, this is gonna be a little dark, but same principle, just make sure you give it a nice little spin and that it moves without any shaft play. Other things you might want to look out for is just general maintenance. Make sure all the seals are good. Make sure the wastegate is nice and closed. And I think on these, because these are electronic, I can't actually force it open, but just make sure it sit seats nice against the exhaust housing. So yeah. Uh, that's the first part to the Type R build.